Hello friends, welcome back to my another new video and in this video I'm gonna be showing you how to fix Axenia error enable to initialize Direct 3D 12 graphics subsystem. So let's get started. Guys you can fix it uh, by using Direct 3D DLL file in your PC. So I have uh, Direct 3D DLL file so extract it with Windrar. So this is the first solution. So I have another solution but uh, we use it first open it and as you can see Microsoft DirectX Direct 3D DLL so go to your computer and local disk C Windows scroll down and search for system 32 bit copy DLL files and paste here continue go back system 64 open it and copy it and paste here continue and it's done so and i have uh, a d3 d12 uh, dll file extracted with winner first and here is the folder open it and as you can see d3 d12 so go to your computer it is windows system 32 bit and copy and paste here continue and go back system 64 copy it and paste here continue it's done close it close it guys you can fix it by using dll files so if this problem does not solve after using uh, d3 dll files then you will have to install directx uh, 10 so i have directx 10 here is extract it with windrar first and here is DirectX uh, 2010. So create a new folder here and open it. Yes. And click browser, select this folder. Go to your disk. So here is the disk. Disk app. disk f and direct x select new folder ok and open this folder and here are all the files after extracting and open direct x 10 next next wait for some time so guys I show you uh, my DirectX I am using so I have DirectX 11 as you can see DirectX runtime version 11.0 so you need a DirectX 2010 to fix this error and it's done installation complete click on finish and and after installing DirectX 2010, you will need DirectX 12 for your Windows. So I am using DirectX 11 because my Windows does not support DirectX 12. So this is why I don't have a DirectX 12. So if you have DirectX 12, then you will have to install DirectX 12 in your Windows. So please install DirectX 12 in your windows to fix this error and third solution of this problem uh, you will have to install latest drivers for your GPU so I am using driver version I show you my driver install drivers version 
I have 471.41 so you can install latest drivers for your GPU for fixing this error in your PC. So hope you like my this video. Thanks for watching guys.